Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Derek, and today we're playing some more Mind Industry. So, in our last episode, we did Grand Zero twice. We got to Wave 20, which is what we needed to unlock both Desert Wastes and the Frozen Forest. I'm not even going to look at these yet. I said I'm not going to look at them yet, but I'm looking at them. In the craters. I assume that would be the craters, then? Reach Wave 60 in Desert Wastes? Christ. Reach Wave 50. 15, sorry, 15. Anyway, in here we've got copper, we've got lead, and we've got coal, and we can't configure our launch, so let's just go. I've turned the music down another one. Alright, first things first, I need to see where they're spawning from, so I know where to build my defence. There's one over there. I do know on some maps there is more than one spawning spot. No, we're quite lucky. They've only got one spawning spot on this map. Righty, righty, righty. Let's just get rid of that. And then let's get our own miners in here. Um, I think I'm going to go straight down there. Straight down there. Down there and down there. And then up there. Oops. Every time I click to make that appear on there. And it's already ready for me want to come this way and go up there and you need to come up and across there right i've got some copper coming in so what we can do <clears throat> is block off other paths and then they're going to come towards my base so i think what i'm going to do um is build some defensive walls down this way can i get the large ones just going to build a few and then hopefully they're not going to come down this path. Really, I don't want them coming straight down. Or maybe I did want them going across the top. <clears throat> maybe I did. Uh, we'll see if that's a problem later on. I don't really want them coming down this path either. So let's block this one off as well. And then we can focus our defence over this way. So I have got scatters on this uh, map as well. I think I'm going to leave them in an open path. No. No, I don't want that. Let's block this path off. Like so, like so. Because I want to be able to build my wall across here. And then they've got to go across this way and up. So that's that sorted out. Let's get these walls built up. I've got two minutes left. All right, duos. Um, let me build these right there. The copper is a little bit on the short side. It's all right. We'll get more in sooner or later. Uh, let's get these mines up and running. Well, we can't get them up and running yet, can we? You can go right there, you can go right there. And you can come down that way, you can come down that way, and come across. Yeah, I think if we go like that, then we can get the router in. Well, the routers in, across that way. What have I got? 1 minute 29 remaining. Let's get some duos across there as well, and then I think we can just set up our defensive wall. You know what, I'm going to put it one further forward, because I think we can get menders on this map. Right, pause that for a minute. In fact, can't I do this down this way, right next to the base? And then I can throw the resources straight in there. Throw that in as well. And we should be good. I think. Come on, build the duos first. Build the duos first. In fact, no, we don't need the duos first. We need the walls now. <clears throat> we shouldn't get much of a first wave incoming. Let's get more copper coming in. I need loads more copper. You can go down there. You can go down there. And you can go down there. I can even plonk one right in the middle there. 
What have we got? 17 seconds? We're good. We've got this. And you can go down like that. Across, across. Down there. And across that way. Which way do I want to bring this in? Am I, am I bringing anything down from this way? No, not yet. Right, first wave is in. Let's just bring that there like that. Where is our wave going then? It's going exactly where we thought it'd go. Just pause that for now. Let's start shooting. Oh, they're flamers. I don't enjoy those. <laughs> Need to get more copper coming in. Come on, we got this. Uh, you can come straight in. Right there. Right, we've got the path in. Oh, I'm going to have to click on them. Oh, no, right. And then with this extra bit of copper coming in, we should be able to finish off our basic defences. <clears throat> Come on. Then we can start getting lead. And then we can start working on the coal stuff, hopefully. Right, that's even more copper coming in. We've got coal over here and we've also got lead. Oh, by the way, if you press F, that's how you make schematics. So we'll look at that a little bit later on. Oh, that's added a junction in there. I did not want a junction in there. In fact, I could put an overflow in this as well. Where's it going to come down? I think we'd snake it down into this path as well. Yeah, let's have an overflow. Um, right. Well, there. Oh, no, no, no. I can't. I've not got any lead. Not got any lead yet. Right, leave that doing what that's doing for now. Uh, we've got a nice little bit of lead tucked away in this back section here. So let's throw that all the way up there. Get that up there and you there. I just wondered if that block was anything we could get rid of. You can come straight down. You can come straight into there. And you can go right there and in. Let's see how our defense handles the next wave. I'm not going to interfere. Oh, cheeky. So I've clearly got to pad this defense out more. Eventually. They take the easiest path. Um, I like my blocks to line up. OCD. That's all I'm going to say. Make sure they can't get this way. It's a little bit overkill on the copper front, but screw it. I can't see them coming through that way now. They've got other ways that they can go. Uh, the lead's coming in, so yeah, let's get the overflow in now. And that was going right there. We can get extra copper coming down uh, this away. I wanted to just join it into this. There we go. So that's extra stuff coming in there. Do I want to get the uh, lead coming in <clears throat> as well? This lead right here. I think we do. Let's get the basic resources going before we start like proper going for everything else. Go there, go there, and go there. Damn it, it got it selected again. You can come across, you can come across, you can come down. And... I'd rather you go to there, honestly. Then let's just follow this down a little bit. Come on. Fine, if you're being like that game. And that should be even more lead coming in. Right, can we start working? With the other stuff. In fact, you know what? I want to make this defensive wall a little bit stronger as well. I've got a feeling they're going to try and just walk through here. And we cannot allow that. Next wave is incoming. 
Let's see where they go. <clears throat> Good, they're going the way I want them to. Right, let's see how the duos handle this. I could add more duos in, actually. Yeah, let's go like that. We're going to use one of these bridge conveyor things. Because that can go straight over there like that. Uh, the only problem I think we're going to have, I don't think it's going to get to them ones right there. Damn it, did not mean to do that. Yeah, I don't think these are going to get ammo. Yeah, they're filling up. I am going to need to get scatters in certain places. Let's get some scatters. Right there. Now, I believe these take lead. Yeah, they take lead. Right, they're built up. Um, I can just pull from this line right here. Um, I want an underflow gate, don't I? Let's just check what that does. Outputs to the front if the left and right paths are blocked. Yep, that's what I want. I want this path to be the priority. Uh, now, I kind of want you to come up this way, please. There we go. And... There we go. That's them scatters being sorted. Let's get some scatters over here as well. And then we've got most of the paths already sorted out. I don't want to put a router. If I, if I put a router there, it's not going to pull in there. No, it's not. Uh, you just go to there. I'm not that bothered about all my conveyor belts being neat, so long as they get things where they need to get to. I'll be fine. Enemies inbound. Here they come. So I want to get towards Menders soon. Oh, they can shoot across that bit. That's not very nice. And they were shooting me there. My bad. Uh, let's just add another row of defense right in the middle there. They can still get through the one block thing. I'm sure they can. Uh, right, let's work on graphite, is it? Can't do silicon, can't do pyrite. So graphite press just requires two coal. So let's see. If I just throw that there and that there. New content unlock, coal. Lovely. Um... What have we got? That's probably one per second. Is that all collectively two per second? If I do that and that, and then have routers just coming in there, does that actually work? Yeah, it does. I don't need that one right there, do I? Right, why are these now not working? Would an overflow gate work better? Because then it's pushing it left and right. I thought the router would have done that. <clears throat> Never mind. So we've got some graphite coming in. They can go there. I kind of want more coming in. Why are you not working again? You know what? It seems to be being a pig. So if I do that, and then that and that, I think that's as efficient as we can make it for now. Doesn't seem very efficient, does it? I mean, it's working as quickly as it can. You know what, I want to try and make a better design for this, because then maybe I can copy-paste it in future. Um, where were we? In here. Graphite press. So if I go one, two, three, four. And 
come across the bottom like this. You go up, you go up. And router. That's a junction. Genius. That might be why it wasn't working before. Go like that and then come across. Yeah. Nope, that is not what I wanted. Save to schematics. Sorry. Let's just call it basic graphite. Sorry. Lovely. So if I come in here now, we've got basic graphite, and I can just click and place this anywhere. Oh, why is it coming back this way? It shouldn't be doing that. That's why I had them pointing upwards. Oh, I see the problem. I see the problem. Let's just cut this out a second. I did it one too close there. And we can place this back down one tile across. In case you didn't see what was happening there, the graphite press was on the end here. So graphite was spawning across into this. That was the problem. K, 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 K. We've got that sorted. Let's get some more of this lovely, lovely lead in. And you can go there. Uh, let's come across and we can go up. And if I just come straight across here, I thought you'd add a junction in, honestly. Because then, oh, missed that one. The lead's going to come across onto this line. Copper's going to co go straight through. Right, where's this wave coming? It's going the way that I want it to go. Beautiful. We want to get the um, power systems up in a second. God damn it, dudes. Oh, he's shooting me. I was paying no attention there. I was more devastated that I'd already lost this. You can't middle... You can middle mass button. I love it. Let's just surround this a little bit. Give it a little bit of defense. There we go. Right, so we've got some coal in the middle here. How about we make use of this? Seems like a plan, right? Uh, I can even get one there just to get a little bit more. And I think I'm going to have you come in this way at. You can come across and down there. There we go. And you come into there. Right, power. How does this work then? Uh, combustion generators. I assume. You know what they say about assuming. Uh, we can just do this and then get a router in. Now, would that be enough to support all of them, is the question. It doesn't really look like it is. What have we got in here? Right, what do these do? Does it tell you? Power use, 72 power units per second. What? No. I want to get the menders in. We need the menders, because I want these walls to keep going. Uh, if we throw them down there, and then if we get up... In fact, I need batteries, don't I? So we can save up the power. I'm just thinking, if I have them all in the same place, we can keep them all protected. Right, that can go there. And there. And there. There. We'll get in there. Oh, they're just walking straight through. Right, if I connect this to one that's already powered, like right there, that should 
Power everything. Love it. Uh, so, need more copper walls in there. And in there. I can get another mender right there. Right, so we've got some menders up and running. Am I still, like, charging? Yeah, we're still charging. And then anything that comes out extra, honestly. How do you rotate it again? Ah, you just roll the mass. Fair enough. Uh, we can have that right there. And that fits in kind of nicely. So yeah, any extra coal that comes through, we can turn into graphite. You can go right there and you can go in. Admittedly, there's not much. <clears throat> so I don't think we've got enough coal coming in to actually overflow this. Um, why did... Why? Why did I... Why? Need a router there. It's a good job we've not had any flying units yet. Uh, I'd also like to get a little bit of flying defense up uh, this away. Maybe I can just pull from this over here. Yeah, let's do that. I'll have a row straight down the middle. We can get one there. I can cover everything there, can't I? Because I can get to every side. Yeah. Which way around are we going to have this? I think it's going to come around the bottom. And go up. Uh, let's just set our scatters. Right there, like that. <clears throat> We've got a next wave coming in. <clears throat> Let's see what happens. I want to get a couple of menders over here as well, actually. Just keep these walls going. Let me just scoot around. Now, they did manage to take a wall down. How far do the menders reach? Because I'm wondering... Could I do that? Because I'm not blocking the pathway. And that. Would that one get reached? Yeah, it would. Any extra defense is going to be good defense. But that is my only defense at the minute. I need more. <clears throat> I could also build another bridgeway across there and block this path off. Uh, one thing at a time. One thing at a time. We need to get this all the way up here. Doesn't matter how it goes. Just get it in. Get it in right there. And we can finish that off. There's all that being forced in. And then with all these resources across this way, you just belong to me, really. Thanks, then. Let's get some more graphite going. Right there. Right there, right there, and right there. And I can just funnel it straight into that. I could. But instead, I think I'm going to give it its own little section. Yeah, just come down like that and go across. Let's get this in right there. That's the one. Remember middle mass button, because that's dead useful. Um, if I come one further across, I could... Actually, well, two further across. I could come down here. Around like this. This will work. Yeah, I can scoot around. Oh, we've got a new enemy coming in. Oh, I never got my menders powered. Ugh, quick. Well, not quick. They're not attacking this way, so it really doesn't matter that much. There we go. And they'll now keep them walls going. Let's see. Can they destroy any of the bigger walls? No, they can't. But this is why I need more defense. You're not shooting me. Keep away. I can't really use that copper. I'm going to have to use our current supplies of copper. Although it does seem like we're full up on... No, we're not full up on lead. I'm being a moron. How are we doing for resources? Only 1k. 
Well, I have been building quite a bit. Let's finish this graphite up. Um, down and across. Nope, that is not how I want this to go. Need to keep it away. There we go. That's more graphite coming in. Now, is this actually able to keep up? The beauty I can do with this, though, is I can just double the other side up. Go like that. And then I'm a little bit screwed there. <laughs> Um, see, I don't know if they offload onto the bridges. I'm fairly sure they don't. So one of those is going to be useless. You can tell if it's getting the little puffs of smoke. I think that is working. Yeah, it's got to be. I don't know how to tell if it's got an inventory. Where's a miner that's stopped? Yeah, it gives you a little icon there if it's got stuff in still. Uh, right, let's get our second defense set up. Because <clears throat> we kind of need more defense, don't we? Um, Where do I want them to come? Really? I'd like them to come down this way. So I'm going to have to block this bit up. Let's go right there. Like that. This is where all my copper's going. It's alright, we're not leaving on wave temp. <clears throat> no, thank you. Uh, we're not going to have much room here. Let's go right there, right there, right there because they can still reach, and right there. Let's get a load of routers in all of this, and then I've just got to get copper to come across to right there. Uh, you also need to be a router there. So it can keep going up should we need it. Uh, we need to get some defensive walls in right there. Oh, that works beautifully. No. I need to move it out one. I want menders. Let's go like that. And menders are right there. I'm hoping the power node can reach everything. No, it can't. Let's just take uh, you right there. Excuse me. You right there then, I guess. Then we'll jump this all the way across to where our power is. Come on. I was going to say, surely there's a spot there. Good. How are we doing for power? To me, we're losing power now. We need more power, Captain. Uh, have I not got any excess coal anywhere or any extra coal? No, I don't. Here comes the next wave. Should we see how they do? Yeah, no extra coal. It's all the flame dudes again. Hey, no it's not. There's some flame dudes in there. It's the bigger... Tougher looking ones, isn't it? Oh, my menders. My menders are glorious. Right, so let's... I hope they can't shoot across that way. I'd never thought about that. So there's the second wave of defense. I like it. Do we think they're going to get much further than that? I mean, I think I'm going to try and stay until wave 20. <laughs> Yeah, it looks like we're only going to be able to do one uh, level this episode. Um, yeah, I'm definitely running out of power there. But it's not because I've not got the coal. Yeah, just take this out. It's not actually doing anything for me. 
How are we doing for graphite and stuff? Yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. Um, silicon smelter. Coal and sand. There's no coal on this map. Pyrotite mixer. Input coal, lead and sand. We can't use that on this map. See, I don't want to use much of this for power. I'm surprised we've not unlocked the next miner yet, honestly. Uh, so I've got air defense there, air defense there, air defense there. I think we can just start skipping levels and working our way up. Because we've got all the resources coming in that I want. I should probably have an overflow on this coming across, but if they breach across to this point, then they're all flame dudes, right? Oh! Nope, they're exploders. Well, they didn't do very well. What are they? For there only to be two of them, that seems a little bit disconcerting. It's alright, I'm behind my wall. Are they like mega flamers or something? They seem to have a fair bit of health. They just look like normal gunners. They're just normal gunners. Oh, maybe they've got increased damage. I don't know, because I had already taken a fair bit of damage earlier. Um, I need to sort this power out, because we are going to run out of power. Maybe I don't need this many. Cut them away. How are we doing for power now? It's going up by, like, one or two. That's fine. We've balanced it. All right, let's keep skipping ways again. Ways? Waves. I know it says we've unlocked the forest station, whatever, but I still want to go to 20. 20 seems like a nice even number. I can't believe we've not had any flyers yet. I built the, all them scatters for no reason. Get lost. What have we got now? They just look like two normal shooters, although I don't want to get hit with them. I could have really built some turrets over there. I don't think they would have reached, honestly. No, they wouldn't have done. They look like flame dudes. Come on. Die, 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 die. Like one of the animes I watch. Just spamming the same word again. You're not going to get through there. It seems weird that it resets. And by resets, I mean we've got round to easier enemies again. Oh no, you took on my corner piece. Did they just come back in with more health or what? Dead weird. Now nah, they look like shooter dudes. Yeah, they're shooter dudes. Keep backing up. I don't need any defences. I've got this myself. Didn't even get a shot off. What do we get now? They look like flame dudes again. Surely wave 20 is going to be more difficult. Hopefully the music's been a little bit quieter for you today. It's down on 1% there. That's just how loud the music is. Really? They are quite beasty. Hmm. We've done well there. In fact, you know what? Before I go, I want to go and get a little screenshot. That'll do. Just move my mouse cursor. I need to remember to do this in... Uh, well, while I'm playing, because then I get better screenshots. Why can we hold up to 6,000, lad? Ooh, I made a boo-boo. Not that it matters now, because we're about to leave, but if we'd have filled up on copper, that would have stopped all my graphite. Uh, I'm not bothered about waiting for, like, a couple of minutes. It's a shame there's not, like, game speed, where we could turn it up. Yeah, I clearly didn't need all eight of them, but I've got the basics, so you know what, there is a slight flaw in that design there as well. That needs to be a router if I ever want it to work. 
So it seems like four would be about the limit for a full belt, because that is quite a full belt. Let's launch. Stop messing around. We're on about 35 minutes. Only rank B. Wow. Although we've got like 7,000 lead. That is ridiculous. So what techs have we got that we can unlock? There's a fair few. Over here, we've got the Alpha Mech Pad. Provides transfer transformation into a basic attack mech. Oh, so we can become stronger. That sounds cool. It doesn't give you any stats on it, but anyhow. Uh, we've got the Scorch. Burns any ground enemies close to it. Highly effective at close range. That would have been good in our pinch point right in the middle. Um, we've got the Hail. A small long range artillery turret. Nice. Uh, what are you? The Arc. A small close range electric turret. Fires arcs of electricity at enemies. Awesome. Uh, what do we need for them ones? We need metaglass and we need titanium and more graphite, obviously. Uh, what else have we got? Pneumatic drill. An improved drill capable of mining titanium. Mines at a faster pace than a mechanic drill. Oh, good. A kiln. Smelt sand and lead into compounds known as metaglass. Requires small amounts of power to run. Fair enough. And the incinerator? Vaporizes any excess items or liquid it receives. I never use them in any sort of games, but I'm fairly sure there is always a use to be had. But that's all we've got to unlock in here. So we need like titanium for these new things. Titanium, titanium. Oh, that needs graphite. I don't really want the message anyway. I'll probably unlock it, but... Launches batches of items without any need for a core launch. Ooh. That seems cool. Anyway, what did we unlock? We unlocked uh, this one right here. Which is... Hello. No, I'm not launching yet. We've got the craters. Uh, we have got copper, lead, sand, coal, and scrap. Is that? It doesn't tell me up here. Maybe I've got to get down there and mine some of it to start with. I've got steam. No, I've not got steam generators yet. Um, power is over this way. That's a steam generator. I need graphite and silicon. But to get silicon, we're going to need to go into the desert waves, I believe. So that'll be where we're going in our next episode. Anyway, that is going to be it for today's episode. So thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more comments and feedback. Greatly appreciated as always. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.